Thank you. And allow me first uh, to amend that CARE is not a Palestinian Israeli uh, organization. It is pure Palestinian, but it does work in joint Palestinian Israeli education projects. We have been working together for more than 30 years, serving the, hum the global human uh, community, and hopefully we will never give up. Our work is focusing on uh, mental health programs and how we can work and promote the four D's values. What are the four D's values? These are dignity, diversity, dialogue, and democracy. After the COVID-19 pandemic, we started to work on mental health issues and to face the issue of domestic violence and family violence in both communities. And we found in Williams' three volumes, My Journey in Life, a good enrichment resource to help our trainers and our trainees that we are working with, for, and by. We have been working in what we call them disadvantaged areas. Professionally, they call them vulnerable areas, both females and males, including parents' councils, teachers' unions, and children and youth organizations. The program started jointly in 1989, but we started CARE in 1988 when Palestinian schools were closed at the beginning of the Palestinian Intifada. So we didn't want to leave our children thrown in the streets because we believe that education has more to do in our area. The Palestinians and the Israelis have been witnessing a lot of violence and violent confrontations, but they rarely witnessed joint cooperative efforts to reduce, if not to abolish, violence. What we are thinking of after this, as you said, hopefully it will be the end of the COVID-19 pandemic. What we are thinking of, three main challenges that CARE has to work on these days. The first is ignorance, and the second is hate, and the third is terror. We managed to develop a poster called Terror is Our Common Enemy, and we took the name of this poster from my presentation in the United Nations at the first anniversary of 19, yeah, the 9th of November 2001 event. The presentation was given at the United Nations Assembly in New York, and I chose terror is our common enemy. Why we are focusing on ignorance? Because it is the main, we see ignorance is the main reason for producing and maximizing hate. And hate yields to terror. So we are going to invest so much in the role of informal education to combat hate and ignorance through investing in the role of faith and informal education. We are going to put these three challenges in the three main programs. The first program is called Empathy, where we are going to work with preschool teachers 
from both sides. And the second program will be first aid mental health for children. And the third program is faith for mental health aid. Hopefully you all will pay more attention and this is our request to your kind guests that you all pay more attention to the area here in the Middle East for this. Because if you want to invest for the future, you have to invest in the children. And thank you so much.